loved ones welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to show you guys my new protective style mm -hmm. so I have been going natural for about almost two years my hair is a 4c it is like <clears throat> very very nappy when I put gel or water on it it kind of crinkles up but the ends to me are like really frizzy and like really afro-y and it's so hard for me to find a product to make it look curly and then when I wet it it's like around this short and I really don't want to rock my hair in its natural state that short I want it to be a little bit longer so I have been <clears throat> getting braids like every month to grow my hair and for me not to it kind of refrains me for from wearing the drawstring ponytail and I think that's where the afro at the ends come from I don't know but it seemed like every time I take my hair down from the braids it'd be like at a decent state but then when I start wearing it in a ponytail and then putting the drawstring on after I take it out it's kind of like nappy I don't know if I wear it too long I'm not sure what the problem is but I'm probably gonna try to stay away from the drawstring ponytails for a while because that's what I've been doing or sometimes I do a sew in like I just took out a quick weave um, so I went back to braids so usually I do a sew-in um, in between the sew-in I do um, just my hair I let my hair breathe and just wear like a ponytail to work then I'll get probably do a quick weave or something then I always go right back to braids <clears throat> okay so on the side I have French braids or cornrows whatever you want to call it I usually call it French braids but YouTube call it cornrows it doesn't look like corn to me so I don't know what where cornrows came from but the side and the back is cornrows and the middle all the way back are individuals okay so this is how the side looks like and the back Okay, and this is the other side. Okay, and this is the back. So I'm going to show you um, how the individuals are right now. Down the center, if you can see that. And I really, really like this hairstyle. And I could take any picture to my my hairstylist and she could duplicate it to the T. I've seen a hairstyle like this on YouTube, but it was like kind of up like this. Kind of like that. And I could wear it like that. So she braided it to where I could wear it in any different type of way. And this hairstyle right here is so versatile, it is just unbelievable. So I wanted to give you guys a couple of styles that I am going to use for um, the style of braids that I have in my hair right now. But I absolutely love it. And I love my stylist because when she braids it, she doesn't braid really tight. So it kind of protects my edges because my edges are really, really thin. And if you pull real hard, they will break apart. So... Um, I was able to sleep the first night after I got my hair braided and if you are in the Inland Empire or Riverside County my stylist is in the Inland Empire so if you want her to braid your hair she's super super affordable she braids really fast and she's not heavy handed so if you want your hair braided you could just leave me a message in my inbox or leave me a message and I will give you her number okay so I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple of styles that I am going to rock with these braids. And like I said, I really like them because they're not really too long, you know, because the summer is here. And she did, um, she razor shaped them and then dipped them in hot water. So they're not extremely long because I really didn't want them that long. But I'm going to go ahead and start with a couple of styles that I am going to do with these braids while I'm having them in and I think these braids will probably last probably a month and a half and at night time I just put some um wrapping solution the foaming kind most of the time I use motions right now I got the argan oil one I really don't like that one so I'm gonna go to Walgreens and get the motions one again and I put a whole bunch of mousse 
on my braids and then I wrap it with like a do-rag and to grease it I usually get an oil pour it in the center of my hand and just finger it through the braids okay so let me get on with the styles okay so stay tuned so those are all the styles that I could come up with as fast as I could and that was like in what five six minutes so you could probably do a lot more styles with this hairstyle like I said this style is very versatile since you do have the individuals down the center um, and the cornrows on the side you could probably do a whole bunch of different hairstyles I could probably put like a ponytail to the side and look like one of the gems from Less Jam. You know, it's a whole bunch of things that you could do with this hairstyle. So if you like this hairstyle, please thumbs up. If you want your hair done, you could leave me a message in uh, leave me a message in the, my messages, and I will definitely give you the number to my stylist. She doesn't charge a lot, and I didn't tell you that before, but um, the front right here, she sewed it down, so it just won't be like in your face. But you could also um, take that out, but. I'm going to leave it like that for right now because I can still wear a ponytail. I can still wear a bun on the top of my head. So there's really no need for me to take um, the string out. So she only sewed like across right here so the braids won't be falling all over the place since they are individuals. But I am loving this hairstyle and I could sleep at night without my head hurting. I just got it done like two days ago. So it's still fresh and clean and it should last me about a month and a half so if I do get any wigs to review or any hair to review I'll probably make a wig and put it on top of this um, over a stocking cap but yeah I really like my hair and I hope you guys like it too so don't forget to please rate comment and subscribe to your girl Chanel Next time, I will see you later. I don't know what video I'm going to do later. I'm trying to knock them out today because it's raining outside. I don't have any of my kids. So, um, I'll probably bring you a makeup tutorial, some more reviews. I don't know. So, thank you guys for tuning in today. Peace.